National Primary Health Care Development Agency reiterated its commitment to give all the necessary support to cooperation and cooperation to Water Aid Nigeria for its actualization of its new plant on water sanitization and hygiene. And the public health sector, which it says will serve as a guide to the agency in budgetary provisions and intervention to primary health facilities in the country. Director and head of Department Health Services from the agency, Dr. Chris Elemowa, who stated this in Balchi during a stakeholders engagement meeting on water sanitation and hygiene situation assessment of primary health care facilities in the state, also lament how wash facilities meant for public consumption are yet to be distributed in the state. Our Balchi state correspondent, Awal Hassan, completes the story. The stakeholders meeting organized by Water Aid Nigeria draws participants from various ministries and agencies in the state, civil society organizations, the media, representative of the National Primary Healthcare Development Agency, as well as other development partners. The aim is to assess and analyze primary healthcare facilities in Bauchi State to be able to also identify the gaps in water sanitation and hygiene. The expectation is once this is done, and um, we have a clearer understanding of where the gaps are. We can now proactively start working on responding to gender issues, ensuring that the facilities are a lot more gender responsive, ensuring that the facilities are responding a lot more to needs of people with disability, ensuring that the facilities are working and functioning effectively, and also ensuring that um, whatever gaps are have been identified that we now start having a proactive response and plan in order to resolve them. Representative of the National Primary Healthcare Development Agency, Dr. Chris Elemowa, was part of the meeting and says these assessment will help the agency, especially in terms of supportive supervision to both the state. This um, uh, assessment now will give us a clearer picture of what, what the situation is like and it will help us to plan it will generate uh, relevant data up, and it will also help us to mount appropriate interventions. You know, it will guide us a lot in, you know, in budgetary uh, provisions and other, other matters so that we know also what to do in terms of supportive supervision and all the rest of them and in terms of more materials uh, to be given to uh, budget state. I overheard that there's a consignment of uh, COVID-19 um, uh, wash materials uh, Line follow yet to be distributed. I mean, the government should make here. The collaboration between Water Aid Nigeria and various stakeholders that are gathered here is also expected to yield a fruitful outcome, which will pave way to ensuring that facilities in the healthcare sector are working effectively. Ultimately, this should really support the states in um, their strategic level planning to ensure that um, economic development priorities are being prioritized and factored in order to improve the level of water sanitation and hygiene service provision in public health care centers. Whatever inputs that will be made, please, I am interested in seeing government taking the driving seat. Please. Water sanitation and hygiene, WASH, has been the cardinal point of water aid Nigeria, especially in the rural communities. And now, the focus is on improving wash in primary health care facilities. Awal Hassan, Viewer TV News, Bochi.